Hello guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel if you're new here. My name is Emma and if you're not new here, my name is still Emma. I have again found myself sitting on the floor in my bedroom because this is the only place where I can maximise the natural light that like there's a window behind the camera right now. Great. Today I'm here to share with you guys what is in my uni bag. This video has been very very highly requested since I like started uni like started last year. So I thought I would finally share what I take with me in this bag every day. I feel like I don't, there's not really much more I need to say to enter this other than let's get straight into it. So to start with, this is the bag that I use. It is from Status Anxiety, so obviously a little bit pricey, but I knew that I was gonna have it for a while, so I didn't mind the extra price tag. Heaps of people just use like the $2 like tote bags from Codnon and stuff. Again, does the purpose. This bag itself is called the Fall of Hearts bag, and I think the color's like tan, new buck or something i don't know if they still make this bag it may have been discontinued because i'm pretty sure i got this on like a clearance sale what i do love about this bag is it has like the shoulder strap which is how i generally wear it like so or it has this big shoulder strap which you can wear it like that which is also detachable has the little clips on either side so in terms of the contents of the bag if i open it up that's kind of how she's looking today this morning i only had like two classes so this isn't as full as it would normally be normally there'd be like lunch and stuff included in here which kind of makes the bag bulge at the seams so what i have for like a standard day if i'm just going for a couple of classes don't need to have lunch with me what do i have well firstly we've got the car keys because i can't actually get to university without them Next, I always take a couple of pens. Oh, I don't handwrite my notes, but a lot of the time they'll pass like in tutorials, they'll roll around and you have to write your name or tick your name off or whatever. And so instead of being the person that's like, hey, can I borrow your pen? I bring my own so that I can just worry about myself. So yeah, those are the two pens I take with me. I found out about these on TikTok. They're these gel pens from Kmart and they're actually really good. Would highly recommend. They come in like a pack of like 10 like different colors. Then we have the AirPods in the little case. I don't actually use these at uni because I mean, I have to use my ears to listen to what the tutor or the lecturer is saying. If I have like a break or something and I'm like in the like study spaces, I'll use these to listen to my online lectures. I do have some cough lozenges in there. I don't normally take these with me, but there they are. Next we have the drink bottle, absolute necessity. I know this looks like a hydro flask, it's not, it's better. I'm gonna do a little plug here, not sponsor at all. I bought this from a surf shop in the Coromandel in the summertime. It's from this company called Dorney Adventure Club. I did a little bit of background research the other day just out of curiosity and boredom in my lecture as to what this company's all about. And it's about like waking up before the sun, getting things done and I was like, that's me. So anyway, Great bottle, this one holds a litre. Great investment, like half the price of a hydro flask, would highly recommend. Then we have my diary. This one from St. Balfour, this is actually gifted and I am an affiliate ambassador for these guys, so I am gonna say good things about this because trust me, I am like a paper lover. I've used many journals, many diaries, and I kind of get to a point in the year, like you guys are gonna be able to relate to this, we get to a point like, eh, like I'm not gonna use my diary anymore. This one, however, very user friendly. It just is very functional, and so I have actually used this like every day. I do have a discount code which is this Emma. I actually came across this. It came up as a sponsored Instagram ad on my feed and then I ended up buying one. Contacted the company. I was like hey I've just received like I've just purchased one. Love it. Would love to like work with you guys. They sent me another one which I then gave away to one of you guys. I'm pretty sure it was Paige. So hello Paige. Hope you're liking your diary. And now um, I work with them which is so exciting. But anyway I take a diary to uni every day just to keep track of like assignments and my to-do lists and things. Then we have the laptop. I know I'm gonna get questions about my laptop case. It's from Typo. I got it like three years ago. It's on its it's on its last legs. But me and Danny both have matching ones. We both got them in high school. We both still have them. Great quality. But yeah, that just has my laptop on it. Oh, and I also have a face mask on my laptop sleeve as well. So now my bag's looking kind of floppy because there's not a heck of a lot left in here. I have a Ziploc bag full of tissues because I don't buy tissues in like those little packets, like the pocket packets. I just make my own pocket packets. I'll just show you guys inside the bag since it's empty, but you can kind of see. It's relatively big. It doesn't have a hope to stretch to it because it is leather. It has these pockets, which is where I keep like my pens, my car keys, and my AirPods. That's where they came from. And then obviously the body of the bag where I have like my drink bottle, my diary, my food if I have it, and my laptop. And then on this side, there's a zip. So I'm gonna expose myself and show you what I have in this little compartment. First up we have pads. I don't need to explain that. Sticky notes because if I need to like write myself reminders or anything, that's where I do that. Rescue remedy because I just I just take this with me everywhere. I have done for years. A lip balm and especially at the moment, I don't know what's going on. I think it's the cold weather, but my lips have been so like dry and cracked and just anyway. 
applying this multiple times a day. A Vivid, I don't have an explanation for this. I just take it with me everywhere. I don't really know why. I didn't actually know it was in there to be honest, but there it is. A spare camera battery. <laughs> I thought this was my other handbag, but there it is. Whenever I'm vlogging, I always carry one with me just in case this battery dies, but that's that. Plaster, some hand sanitizer, some IBS medication. <laughs> and my FBOSS card. And that is everything. This little bag can fit, well it's not that little, but this bag can fit a lot of stuff in it, which is great. That's kind of everything I take to university. A lot of people, I feel like I'm gonna get questions about this if I don't address it, but a lot of people still use school, like the backpacks you use at school. I was gonna do that, but then I was like, I think I just want something different. I'm happy to leave my backpack in high school, move on. A lot of people do use bags like this, but I mean, it's really like, some people don't even bring bags, they just bring a drink bottle in their laptop and then just call it a day. So it's really personal preference. This is just what I do personally. A lot of people who are still in high school get a bit confused as to what you're actually supposed to bring to university with you on a daily basis, because I know I was confused about that my first day. I was like, I don't know what I need. For the most part, like you get textbooks and stuff in your classes or you have to buy textbooks and you don't have to take them to class with you but I sometimes do just if I feel like I'm gonna need it which is very very rarely. I think that pretty much covers all bases. Um, I've now got a pile of all my contents in my bag sitting next to me which I need to put back in here. So hopefully that helps you guys. Um, I know there's a lot of people that are watching this are probably just nosy so hello. I am a nosy person too so that's okay. Thank you guys for watching. Stay safe, stay well, make someone smile and I'll see you in my next video. Oh, hang on. And the extra pin. There are a 